<laughs> so you guys, I'm going to start right now because we have at least 85 people. So 85 people, um, feel free to invite. Um, I'm Yo Pickles. If you guys are the first person, first time watching me, um, I am starting this. Love the lips. I'm starting this past the tat um, for people to get a chance to share their tattoos and share their stories from around the world. I think it's going to be really fun. And if you guys are tattooed or not tattooed, it's still fun to hear the stories. And maybe you can get all the questions that you've ever always wanted to ask someone with tattoos. You can ask the questions and pass the tat. So maybe, why did you get that tattoo? Or what does that tattoo mean? <laughs> Those are the kind of questions that I get asked all the time. And this is like the best way to tell 100 people your story and why you got that tattoo and the story behind the tattoo. So we have, plus me, we have seven people. I do read your messages. Seven people that um, are going to tell their story along with me. Um, and I'm really excited. So I'm going to start while people are coming on. I'm going to pick a tattoo. Actually, I haven't even prepared for myself. <laughs> I haven't prepared. But okay, I'll just go for my sleeve. My sleeve is a good one because it's big. So you guys, I have a sleeve. Um, I got it done about three years ago in South Korea. I've always wanted a sleeve. And I wanted a colorful sleeve. And the meaning, there's not really a like a crazy meaning. Like this person means this person, this, 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 this. Um, my birthday's on Halloween. So everything is Halloween on the sleeve. Um, so, yeah, I wanted some Halloween, so I actually have, like, a little Halloween coffin. The peacock actually does mean something. My sisters, all my sisters and myself have a peacock. Um, it wasn't, like, a planned thing. We all, like, let's get peacocks together. We just all have peacocks. Um, and, you know, the jack-o'-lantern. If you guys don't know, spider web on your elbow actually is a gang, gang, <laughs> a gang symbol. But I put a heart in the middle just to show that it's not a gang thing. It's more for love and stuff. And then, let's see, Halloween stuff. So spiders. And I actually had my Korean artist sign his Hongul name. So it says Memento. And wait, let me get up so you guys can see better. Yeah, I'm a gangster. And then it just goes into a cupcake. I have a, my birthday cupcake, which if you guys look at it, it's kind of strange. There's a spoon, which last time I checked, I didn't eat cupcakes with spoons. And then on this side, there's a, there's a bone, so it's kind of strange, but that's Korea style. And then the jack-o'-lantern, the black cat, and all the fun things in my sleeve. Um, it's kind of like where's water. There's so many pictures inside. Like, the more you look at it, the more you see stuff. I got the strawberry from my best friend. I told her she had a little space on my arm to pick something, and she said, I want a strawberry. So I got her a strawberry, and it goes along with all the other fun stuff. So, yeah, this is my sleeve. So there's not really a fun story, but yes, the elbow hurt really bad, actually. He did my elbow after um, five hours of getting another part done, and he went right to the elbow, which was really a tough spot, I must say. And he had me up like this on a table, so mm, it wasn't a fun thing, so... <laughs> yeah, it's actually pretty awesome, and the tattoo artists in Korea are pretty awesome, so... Um, if you guys don't know, I'm actually trying to help legalize the tattooing in Korea. It's not legal and not regulated, so there is some sketchy shops here. But what I do is help um, find all the good shops and the good artists. And I actually have a tattoo Facebook group for all the artists in Korea, and it's actually to help foreigners and English speakers connect with the underground scene in Korea. So if you guys want to check it out, it's Inked Korea. Liz just posted up there. Um, there's a group and there's a page. The group I actually post every day on. So if you guys want to uh, go check it out, it's called Inked Korea. So <laughs> I think it's time to start. I hope you're ready, Shay. Shay, are you ready? And if you are ready, can you put in the messages, I'm next, follow me, and people can follow you and make sure they get their, um, get their notification. And you're pretty much about us. Thanks. Oh, there you go. Uh, Shayla? Shayla. Her name's Shay. You can call her Shay. She's actually next. If you guys want to uh, go click her name and follow her, um, I'm going to invite you in too as soon as... Uh, she goes live. I'm going to go in and invite everybody in. So if you guys want, there's going to be a lot of people coming in randomly, probably thinking it's a pickle bomb. So just put up the hashtags, pass the tat or anything, and feel free to ask any any questions you have to her. And uh, I'm not sure if KYNG is on. If he's not, then um, if we don't see him in your next broadcast, when you're about to go next, we'll skip and go to the next person, which I think is Chris. 
No, my dirt. I think my dirt. So we'll have to organize it a little bit if he doesn't come in. Hopefully he's here. So I'm passing this off to... Oh my gosh, someone just called me. What the hell? <laughs> oh my god. Okay, I'm passing this off to Shay. Um, Shay, if you're ready, you're more than welcome to go live now. I will see you guys soon.